think it's worth taking a chance in Arisaka. The fuck was that? God, how are you so fucking stubborn? Inherited your finer traits. You absolutely sure? No going back on this, you know. Yeah, just don't freak out. Honestly, couldn't give a natch shit. Got a feeling you're gonna regret this decision. And the moment that dawns, I won't be there to help. Could be my last ride, this. If it don't work out, uh... Just wanna be there for it. Where? Mikoshi. Johnny? Okay, just me now. At last. Your offer, I accept. You took your time. In the interim, Yorinobu has made his move. What do you mean? My brother has made me his guest at his residence in North Oak. Locked you in? Yes. His people watch over me for my safety. Think Yorinobu knows? Many things might have raised his suspicions. I do not see any other reason for him to hold me here. Sounds bad. What now? We can delay no longer. I must leave this place. I need your help to do so. Where are you? At Victor's, my ripper dock, back behind a small shop called Misty's Esoterica. I will send someone for you. They will drive you to the residence. Then we shall visit my brother together at the Arasaka Tower. Is that you, V? Or... Yeah, it's me. So, what now? Waiting for my driver. Come inside. We'll wait together. You have to wait. Mind if I give you a reading? Sure, why not? Some believe uncertainty is an evil that should be dispelled through divination. Others claim it's change that is evil. But that isn't true either. Every minute of every day, we each become someone new. We shouldn't fear change itself, but only who we might change into. Knowing one's path is most important. I devised this layout especially for you and Johnny. Your future is his future, and vice versa. Okay, I'm ready. We'll start with you, V. The Fool. <laughs> what a surprise. The Fool symbolizes the start of a... It's the inner child. Sounds a lot like the V I first met. The magic. Sounds like Johnny. A car. Okay, he is one group. The devil. Got another deck lying around. A cheerful one. This is no joke, V. An inverted devil symbolizes subjugation, losing control, aggression, evil, 
A power struggle. Whatever you're planning, treat this as a warning. Okay. Fenjani's? The moon. Whoa, that doesn't sound too bad, right? I don't know, V. The moon is mystery. <laughs> I think that's for you. Wait, is that... an Arasaka stretch? That's right. But... V... They killed Jackie and... And now you're working for them? Think I don't remember? Don't like it any more than you do. But all the other options were worse. Betraying a friend. You can't justify that. Got no right to judge me. You've changed. For the worse. So, this is where Arasaka's finest technology wound up. Charming. Where's the Ripper? Telling fortunes from rat bones in the back? That's right. Matter of fact, just foretold I'd break your shit spewing jaw. Remember the last time I did that, I trust. I do. But I also recall what we spoke of that day. The construct in your head, and how it could affect decision-making. The same construct that, in its former life, detonated two nuclear warheads inside Arasaka Tower. And now, you and this construct have volunteered to sort things out in Arasaka. Interesting coincidence, wouldn't you say? It is. But not nearly as interesting as your paranoia. Honestly think I'm running some kind of ruse. I don't know what to think, but I shall be watching you. Let us go. We are almost there. Why has she not called? Who? Hanako? I fail to see what you and your sharp wits are doing here. Or why I am here. Driving Master V. Easy on her, all right? Don't want to damage the fucking wheels. What am I? Your chauffeur? I didn't agree to this. <laughs> Neither did I, matter of fact. So just shut up and drive. Fun part. The limo is Arisaka, but there will be guards past the checkpoint. Try to act natural. Or rather, just be still and calm, and this will all go smoothly. Is everything in order? No one is allowed onto the estate until further notice. By order of Yorino Arasaka. Hanako is expecting us. Be a good chap and don't make this difficult. Hmm? By order of Yorino Arasaka. You must be joking. Surely you know my face. I do. But not his. Identify yourself. I don't have time for this, sir. Hanako Arasaka is expecting us. Stay where you are. Oh, couldn't be worse. Back up will get here in seconds. Fuck! <laughs> Fucking hell! Prem Hellman. Now what was it you said about acting natural? Oh, piss off! Blast it all. What now? They won't let us anywhere near her. Have to plow right through him, then. Knock yourself out. You fetch Hanako, I'll sort out the AV. Oh, 
I am in the bedroom in the central part of the building. And as you get the AV. But first, we must neutralize the four guards. V, is your task clear? Uh -huh. We neutralize. I will obstruct their communications so that no support arrives. outside and a dweller in the garage on the left. I'm nearing the residence. Good. Land by the pool. No blood was spilled. This is good. For now, could get a lot uglier down the line. You ready for that? Always. I believe a war has just begun. War is a bit much, isn't it? Though a loaded word for any Arasaka. Is that what you believe? Just counting bodies. You and me and Hellman makes three. <laughs> Actually, two and a half. Anyway, against all Arasaka and its armies, that's not much. 
My brother is not all of Arasaka. Not yet, at least. He knows this well. It is the reason he surrounds himself with criminals like Adam Smasher. That's supposed to make me feel better. Reality is we're on our own. My father was on his own, and he built an empire. Please. Is it not too early for champagne? <coughs> but if it helps you calm down, does anyone else have trembling hands? No need. My hands are fine. I might beg to differ, V. Uh, felt better. How do you mean? Get these, uh... Blackouts. Hellman? If I had to guess, his central nervous system is a shambles. Honestly, it's a miracle he can still walk. We must make haste. Once Yorinobu has been dealt with, we shall attend to your needs. Prepare everything. Quite. This way. Probably won't get another chance. To do what? To fill me in on your plan. What if I have none? Don't play dumb with me, Hanako. Mm -hmm. You and Takemura had a plan the day of the parade. Moments later, you had nothing. Your plan was in tatters. And yet we are here now. Do you know why? Because sometimes you have to look the truth in the eye. Back then, that is what I did, thanks to you. You have a 
a very honest look. That's how we're swinging the Arasaka board? You want me to stare at them? Weapon at the ready. If my charms don't work, we go for more tried and tested methods. I see what you're getting at. You have yet to see. As do they all. Where are we actually going? This is one of Arasaka's most closely guarded secrets. Hang on, is this...? Father's office. A faithful replica of the original in Tokyo. He ordered one made in every Arasaka branch on the planet. Every last detail. Every item. Arranged as if he could navigate it blind. That is the way he is meticulous, fastidious. Was. I beg your pardon? Meant to say was. Symbols are more resilient than you think. The question is if the faction leaders remain loyal to Arasaka values, and if they will find the courage to admit their mistake. Odds of that happening are... Higher than you may think. Come. Going down. I told you. Mikoshi can be accessed only from a room beneath Arasaka Tower. Before we interrupt this board meeting, we must do one more thing. Huh? Keep getting this weird feeling you're not telling me the whole truth. Because I am not telling you the whole truth. I am cautious. Thought you said we trusted each other. There is trust between us now. That is why you are here. Though so earlier, soon after you abducted me, I sought his counsel. Uh, whose? Father's. His office is not the only replica he created. What? Otosama. Konohito yo. Omae wa wagasha kara nusumi wo hataraita. Fuck me, Dizzy. さらには娘の誘拐に加担し今度は息子を葬り去ろうとしている荒坂に随分と恨みがあるようだながっ that right you bastard V Silverhand sends his regards あなたの言う通りだな確かにただものではない行きましょう彼がバカなことをしてかす前に準備はいいぞ花子始めろお父様It is done. We may go. Wait a sec. Wanna to talk to Jackie Wells? Who? You took his body. Arasaka did. Goro said you interrogate the dead. Think I might understand how that's possible now. I'm afraid these are two wholly different things. But let us see. Jackie Wells. Hermano! Finally! 
Mama told me things come to those who wait. <laughs> Some are even good. Jackie, it's really you. <laughs> Not bad being heir to the Arasaka Empire. Remember anything about what happened? Hit the Major Leagues essay! Running with Dex! Badass Black Jesus of the Afterlife! A heap of Bartley gold-plated cool! Not bad, eh? Hey. Never did get the chance to thank you. Knew I could always count on you, Jack. Shot of vodka on the rocks, lime juice, ginger beer, oh, and most importantly, a splash of love. Misty misses you. Loads. Oh, Misty. Listen, amigo, uh, I got this thing. And if I borrow your wheels? Got a date with Misty, but I can take the metro. How's that gonna look for me? Seen enough. It's not him. Afterlife. See you there. Did you get what you expected? No damn well I didn't. I warned you it would be something wholly different. Something. Well said. And so we must move on. I... Johnny... Fuck no. Oh, no. Not now. It won't be much longer, V. Will you stay with us? Growing weaker by the minute. We gotta hurry. Indeed we do. Dire moments are upon us. These your people? In a manner of speaking. Meaning? To what extent they have faith in me or my money, I do not know. Guess it'd be all the same to them, wouldn't it? You are never one to mince words. That's why you brought me here. Anyway, motivations aside, what's important is that they shoot in the right direction. As a last resort. And only then. You mean when the board rejects every word out of our mouths? If. Not. When. Then what? You mean to neutralize them, too? Keep your weapon at hand. And do not utter a word until I ask you to. No matter what happens, you must trust me. It's an island. Just one. With 12,000 inhabitants. We could relocate them. Who is this person? Security! I am late. Apologies. Hanako, what are you doing here? My brother. Where is he? He... told us to start without him. Then, begin without him, we shall. Begin what? The removal of Yorinobu from his position as CEO of Arasaka. Did I hear you correctly? What... what are you doing? You cannot... Oh, Hanako... I believe you owe us an explanation. V, this is your seat. I will not let you treat me this way. Are you deaf? Give up your seat. Now. This is outrageous. 
Much obliged. Yorinobu murdered my father and exploited his death to justify his warmongering. And you knew of this. All of you. Fascinating. Absurd. Careful what you say. Yes, indeed. Worse than nothing else. Is this all you have? I have an eyewitness. It's true. All of it. Saw it with my own eyes. What did you see? I saw Yorinobu strangle Saburo Arasaka. Ah, more interesting with each minute. A serious accusation, admittedly. But nothing more. If our testimony is not enough, perhaps you will listen to my father. Oh. This? Is this to convince us? A magic trick. Mahetto, Omae ga militek to mo senmen senso o yuryo shiteita toki. あたしはこういったはずだ。お前には3つのものが欠けている。自身、自制、そして根性だ。荒坂様。荒坂様。What Objections? What the hell's happening? Clearly, someone objects. Who activated the lockdown? Is it you? Is this your doing, Hanako? To lock us in here so we devout. For each other like rats in a cage? Hear that? Have you brought more of this filth from the street? I can't. I did not believe you'd go to such lengths. I will gather a force and take control of Arasaka Tower. You must find my brother. This lift will take you to the upper atrium. From there, you can reach Yorinobu's floor. I want him taken alive. Alive? After all this? He is still my brother. If you harm a hair on his head, our agreement will be void.
the hall, there is an atrium in lift shaft. Be careful. I have heard there is fighting on this level. Disable all the elevators. My people will take back the control room shortly. Go to the lift in the middle on level 3. Quickly. Good. There are more stairs on the opposite side. Join you once we have the situation under control. Two thousand sixty seven. An Arasaka bodyguard shields the Emperor of Japan from an assassin's bullet. Two thousand seventy one. Arasaka security forces prevent mass riots in San Francisco, saving the city from certain ruin. Two thousand seventy four. An Arasaka investigation eliminates a terror cell in Rio de Janeiro, ending a string of attacks and executing those responsible. You will receive net run of the force. Smasher. Finally. Done and gone. What's your take, Johnny? Son of a bitch. It's basically scrap. I suppose it'll have to do. And Smasher, don't bother trying to get up, you pile of junk. How about that, Johnny? 
That was for you. Almost there. I am as well. Remember, do not harm a hair on his head. I remember. Privilege is all yours. Violent delights with violent ends. You? Is my sister. <clears throat> you mean your beloved sibling? One of your men almost shot and killed. She was to remain at the estate. Stay out of the way. I tried to protect her. Any danger she was in was because of you. No one else. Where is she? Be here any sec now. Until then, I'm supposed to watch you. So don't try anything. What would I try? I have tried everything. Nothing else remains. This you won't need. Just one bullet left. It's not for you. Look, what do you see? Terror and deaths that could have been avoided. Avoided? You've lost. It is they who have lost. Kyoto. Dubai. These people had a chance today, but they lost it. A chance? A chance for what? To forget their fear. This is how you want to help people forget their fear. By killing them. Sorry. Just don't get it. Fear. Remember, the one thing I cannot deny him. He knew how to cause fear in people. Saburo. He once told me anything of value is only a flag blowing in wind. And wind is fear. And then, you know what he did? Blew in my face. That was the one time. He was wrong. And others? It worked on them. They feared him. Even now, you saw. Idiots terrified of a dead man talking from a box. Pathetic. I would change that. If only you did not appear. To think you once dared to lead your own gang. Drop that. All your dreams, ideals, to seek power. Power? Huh? Truly, power? Fifty years ago, terrorists blew this building into smoke. Yeah, so I heard. What did it give us? Not much. Nothing. But I learned lesson. If planting bombs not enough, what can you do? You become bomb.
Nie sam. I thank you, V. That will be all. Not all. Not yet. I will keep my end of our agreement. You will go with Helmut. And you? I must stay with my brother. Come. Time to look to your problem. Fate is a fickle mistress, isn't she? Say what now? You spend your whole life fighting something. Only to become that very same thing. Quite literally. Couldn't stomach betrayal. Wait, that's what you think? I betrayed you? Worse. Lawrence, you betrayed yourself. What the hell do you mean by that? Biochip did more than just blend our memories. That line that kept V and Silver and Seven. Well, Fading a while back. I'm still here. I know what I want, and I know where I came from. I, I, I. Who's this I? You even know? I'm That's the seriously who what you want. Live. Same drive that kept Silver in. That drive and two thoughts. Never look back. Never look to those around you. Just keep moving. Look ahead. Stare death straight in the eye. You're not the only rebel around here. And I'm not the only one to have missed a bigger picture. We're a tangled web, you and me. One in the same. So if you're here to tell me something, it's because you need to hear it yourself. When 
you to hear me out. Let me explain all this. Explain? Oh. Then talk. Listen. I'm on an operating table getting sliced open. Our socket docks are taking the chip out as we speak. I mean, you knew it'd end this way. That the day would come when I'd want to be normal again. Want my life back. Normal's overrated. If it exists at all, they're cutting a piece of us out. And that'll leave a hole forever. What choice did I have? Stay true to yourself? Give a thought to a tiny concept called loyalty? If you're all paranoid about being thrown in another Arasaka prison, don't be. They're gonna shred you. You're never gonna get it. It's not about Arasaka. Not even about life and death. Then what's it all about, Johnny? Enlighten me. The principle, V. It's always about the principle. Swap meat for chrome, live a BD fantasy, whatever. But at the end of it all, it's the code you live by that defines who you are. Ever get lost? It shows you the way home. Bust up into pieces? It puts you back together again. That rocker boy Silverhand's credo? Words he lived by? Something Johnny picked up from V. The old V. I don't want to drag this out. Just... See you around, Johnny. And thanks. For everything. If not for you, I'd be long dead. Several times over. Remember what Dex asked you? Quiet life or blaze of glory? Sure, I remember. Shame you chose wrong. Damn shame. In addition, numerous brain functions remain dormant. The neural impulses have been rerouted to the neural processor, a temporary measure. When can I expect a full report? I will send it by the end of this week. My congratulations again on your success. Goodbye. Please prepare the patient's room. I'm... I'm hearing... purple. What, what the... The synesthesia is temporary. We had to create additional synapses in your brain. I think I'm gonna be sick. Where's... what? Where's Johnny? The construct has been cleared from all engrams. The madness is past. So... We shredded him, as agreed. Having... trouble remembering... how I got here. Some memories you have lost permanently. Others will return in time. You must stay calm. Your neural processor is overburdened. Any unnecessary stress response will only make things worse. Um... Am I still V? I... I died... twice, I... Everything is in order. No... I feel empty, as if I'm being pulled, stretched. Please take the patient away. Notepad. Progression and its further trajectory remain unclear. Removing the tumors proved a difficult task. But the operation on the engram was the real challenge. Is the ship of Theseus, Let's dismantled go. into component parts and reassembled, still the same ship? Um. Please take the patient away. 
We are pioneers, the first to ever separate mentally conjoined twins. Yes, in the end, even the human soul can go under the knife. End of note. When in Kyoto, I hear the cuckoo calling and long for Kyoto. Huh? Please rest. A doctor will be with you shortly. Waiting for you. Today is truly a historic day. Today, technology has fulfilled the promise left on me by religion. Please get ready. Testing will begin shortly. No, good morning. I've got some good news for you. We must complete a series of tests. Please do not hinder or delay. Parietal lobe examination. Please use your Kiroshi scanner and read the displayed text. Please use your... And it was a sight to behold, he said, how a soul would choose its life. Sometimes pitiable, sometimes laughable, at times wonderful and strange. That's enough. Cognitive function test. Solve the cube. Hmm.
please link yourself to the device? Higher order representation formation, initiating test. The patient is ready to be examined. What are these tests meant to... test? Initiate device calibration. Respond to the keywords. No thinking, just the first word that comes to mind. Journey. Life. Home. Uh, I don't know. Enemy. The city. Principal. Johnny. Betrayal. Arasaka. You're in a cornfield. Tall, green plants as far as the eye can see. The sun is bright, blinding. The stalks of corn part as you walk forward. You come across a clearing left by an automated combine in its wake. What's this test for anyway? It tests your level of empathy. The heat has made your mouth dry and sticky. You spot a rodent's nest at your feet. The machine has torn through the soft soil. You spot blind, newborn field mice around their mother. The machine has left her sliced in two. They lie in perfect symmetry, a tiny rodent rosette. Your mouth begins to water. What's wrong with me? A shadow gradually falls over the ground. The first rain cloud of the year. Hmm, yes. Right. Measurements complete. How'd I do? We will see. Motor function test. Please step onto the treadmill. Motor function test. Please connect to the device. What's this test all about? Please walk. Gradually accelerate. What's this supposed to prove? I already know I can walk. We must complete a series of tests. Please do not hinder or delay. doing please control your breathing accelerate by three Shit. get up you can't stay here
is an abomination, born of unchecked vanity, technocratic arrogance, complete moral collapse. Our position is clear. Suburo Arasaka's seizure of power is a violation of international law. International arbitration is absolutely necessary to... Do we really want to live in a world where the rich and powerful can become immortal? Where they can continue to take from the poor? Not only their livelihoods, but even their bu- You are gods! 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 Line is not for trade! Line is not- But Saburo Arasaka has issued his response in similarly strong terms. There will be no appeasement. Arasaka Shanaibu no dekigoto ni kanshite.外部の方々に問いかく言われる筋合いはありません。生を受けることに許可が必要ない以上、蘇ることも同様であると考えるべきです。私が息子を殺めたなどという主張は事実無根。法的根拠もありません。合意の上での身体の譲与は一種の寄
cognitive function test. Solve the cube. longer we need very precise data can't stand this anymore cognitive function test solve the cube Up. Respond to the key words. No thinking, just the first word that comes to mind. Loyalty. No. Want to talk to Hanako Arasaka. Please respond to each term with the first thing that comes to mind. Quick as I can, no thinking, right? Humanity. Enough! No more tests. I refuse to take any. Please step onto the treadmill. As quickly as you can, without thinking about it. V. Hanako Arisaka. Want to talk to her now. Cognitive function test. Solve the cube. Fuck! No! Enough! I've had it! Fucking hate this place! Is it 
actually morning? The sun rose over Night City exactly two hours ago. Someone really ought to clean this mess up. What do you want? They asked me to speak to you. So Saburo Arasaka's returned. In your Nobu's body. We live in strange times. Not freaked? That doesn't faze you? Half my life I worked to give Saburo Arasaka immortality. In so doing, I grew accustomed to the thought of his... Uh, resurrection. It's not just his immortality. Saburo stole his own son's body. Saburo is the first human to ever reach for and achieve a divine state. The gods stand above good and evil. No. Alt Cunningham was first. A surprising comparison. Yet accurate on many counts. Fine. So what do you have to tell me? I fear I'm the bearer of bad news. Listen to me. The procedure was a success. We removed the biochip. But the damage it wrought proved enormous. At the genetic level, altered DNA. The kind you would find in those suffering from radiation sickness. And sadly, it's lethal. Fuck. Fuck! Things are bad, yes, but we have not given up. All the options have yet to be exhausted. How much time I got? Approximately six months then things will deteriorate quickly. The time before your ultimate demise will be worst. Most taxing. Wanna talk to Hanako Arisaka? I'm afraid that's impossible. We had a deal. And both sides fulfilled their respective ends. You, your case, your troubles, no longer interest Hanako. Hanako Arisaka promised to save my life. Precisely why she sent me here to discuss your options with you. What other options are there? Already gone under the knife once. Arasaka Corporation has the capability to cheat death. All we require from you is a dose of trust. Trusted you once already. Fat lot of good that did me. You may join our pilot program. Secure your soul. I fear your body is no longer of any use. You must abandon it. We will create an engram of your mind and store it in Mikoshi. Store it? Why can't I just get a new body? We have yet to solve the compatibility issue. Doesn't sound like you had much of a problem with Saburo Arasaka. You have no offspring. Nor do you have an entire clinic focused solely on your care. How am I supposed to know this isn't another one of your tricks? A trick? Maybe Arasaka just wants to punish a pain-in-the-ass thief. Maybe Saburo just wants another soul in his collection. The Arasakas have become gods. You are nothing to them. Insignificant. So this has to be your sweet revenge. Look at you. Your life's work has turned Saburo into a god. Yet here you stand, a mere mortal. That would make two of us. Why would I seek to punish my companion in distress? My employer has made you an offer. We should finish discussing it. So let's say I agree. I'll land in Arasaka's soul prison. Put myself at their mercy. Do I even need to ask about the catch? All is set forth in a contract, guaranteed therein. You must merely sign it. If you wish to live, that is. Now, since a digitized psyche is not legally an individual, the contract entails relinquishing your rights. A temporary measure, naturally. No, not about to become the property of Arasaka Corp. Current participants of the program are all well-known, influential people. We have yet to receive any complaints. And if I refuse? Your belongings are packed. 
A shuttle will take you back to Earth, and you will be dead before winter. It's no easy decision, I know. You should think it through carefully. I want to live. As do most. There's no point in delay. We can begin immediately. See you... in the future, I hope. Yes, see you. Our staff will take it from here. Hey, what's your name? Hajime. Hajime. Let me ask you something. What would you say to a person who walked right into their greatest foe's jail to save their life? Hmm. I would say... All right. But do not forget the way home. Badlands is pleasant as usual. 
cooler melted, it's 90 degrees in the shade, and there's a sandstorm heading straight for us. So, yeah, you're missing out. No, but seriously, we're, we're all getting by. Family never stops growing. Work's always piling up. Sometimes all I wish for is a good night's rest. But oh well. Can't have everything, right, B? You know what I mean. Let me know when you get bored of the city. I'll take you for a nice, long ride. All right, now. Take care of me. Hello, B. Um, Saul speaking. Heard about something big happening in Night City, with a certain V in the lead role. Uh, don't know what you plan to do now, but just remember, we always take care of our own. And, um, you're one of us now, V. You're an Aldo Caldo. Remember that. Ah, uh, take care of yourself, V. And see you around. V, hey! Can you hear me? Shit, is this thing recording? Okay, well, all of us have been wondering when you're finally gonna drop by. We can get a barbecue going, knock a few back, do a couple of races, or pay a friendly visit to the Raff and Shiv. Guess what I'm trying to say is, well, Badlands could use a badass like you, V. Don't know what you got on your plate right now, but remember, you're welcome out here anytime. All right, now, take care. Hey, Rogue here. I wanted to... Oh, voicemail. <laughs> Why not? V? I was wondering if you could pass a message along to Johnny. Two messages, actually. One that he's an arrogant, egotistical son of a bitch. And second, that it was nice to talk to him again. Both of you, take care of yourselves, okay? Hey, V, so funny thing just said, oh, fuck, fuck, sake, voicemail again. Do you ever answer the phone, like ever? Seriously. I can get through to data term customer service faster than you. What did I even... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know that us cracks agent called me and asked if I would go on tour with them? At first, I was like, oh, my dead fucking body. But then I thought, hey, wait. I could actually be fun. So, I don't know what else. Well, there's the latest gossip for you, if you even care. Call me back when you can, okay? Peace out! B, hey. So, here's the thing. A couple fellas from the 5th Precinct busted a shop selling illegal iron. Sawed-offs, stun guns, mustard gas canisters. Orders from on up were to blow it all to the ground. But then I thought, maybe there's a better way to use all this stuff. For a good cause. I still remember what you did for us. For me and Randy. The city needs more people like you. But I'm gonna make sure they're equipped. This one's on me, V. See you around. Hey, it's Perales. V, you're gonna wanna hear this. But first, you need to go somewhere no one's listening. Okay, so my wife, Elizabeth, she's in on the whole thing. She, she keeps saying I should look after myself. Tells me to take these pills. Says they're vitamins. Got them analyzed at a lab. And they look okay. But, but how am I supposed to know if somebody didn't falsify the results? Well, 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 when, when you got a sec, call me, okay? Oh, oh yeah, and don't forget to delete this message. Orbital connections cost an arm and a leg, so I'll just get right to it. I was just thinking about you, so I laid out a quick tarot and... Oh dear. The Fool, the Moon, the High Priestess. Those, uh... Those are bad cards. 
Keep a close eye on your new friends, V. I mean it. Made my decision. I'm going back to Earth. Going home. You will die there. Goodbye, Anders. Your offer was shit. But in making it, you gave me something better. What are you talking about? Before, death was inevitable. A fact of my shit life. You let me choose it. Accept it on my terms. always piling up. Sometimes all I wish for is a good night's rest. But oh well. Can't have everything, right, B? You know what I mean. Let me know when you get bored of the city. I'll take you for a nice, long ride. All right, now. 
Take care of me. Hello, V. Um, Saul speaking. Heard about something big happening in Night City, with a certain V in the lead role. Uh, don't know what you plan to do now, but just remember, we always take care of our own. And, um, you're one of us now, V. You're an Aldo Caldo. Remember that. Ah, uh, take care of yourself, V. And see you around. V, hey! Can you hear me? Shit, is this thing recording? Okay, well, all of us have been wondering when you're finally gonna drop by. We can get a barbecue going, knock a few back, do a couple of races, or pay a friendly visit to the Raff and Shiv. Guess what I'm trying to say is, well, Badlands could use a badass like you, V. Don't know what you got on your plate right now, but remember, you're welcome out here anytime. All right, now, take care. Hey, Rogue here. I wanted to... Oh, voicemail. <laughs> Why not? V? I was wondering if you could pass a message along to Johnny. Two messages, actually. One, that he's an arrogant, egotistical son of a bitch. And second, that it was nice to talk to him again. Both of you, take care of yourselves, okay? Hey, B, so funny thing just said. Oh, fuck, fuck, sake. Voicemail again. Do you ever answer the phone? Like, ever? Seriously. I can get through to data term customer service faster than you. Uh, what did I even... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know that us cracks agent called me and asked if I would go on tour with them? At first, I was like, over my dead fucking body. But then I thought, hey, wait. I could actually be fun. So, uh, what else? Well, there's the latest gossip for you, if you even care. Call me back when you can, okay? Peace out! B, hey. So, here's the thing. A couple fellas from the 5th Precinct busted a shop selling illegal iron. Sawed-offs, stun guns, mustard gas canisters. Orders from on up were to blow it all to the ground. But then I thought... Maybe there's a better way to use all this stuff. For a good cause. I still remember what you did for us. For me and Randy. The city needs more people like you. And I'm gonna make sure they're equipped. This one's on me, V. See you around. Hello, V. From what I understand, you have less than six months to live. I do not know how you plan to spend this time. Perhaps you have chosen to put your feet up, rest, ponder life's meaning. Or perhaps you continue to do what you are good at. If that is the case, my father and I would gladly retain your services. You would be compensated generously. Six months will pass faster than you imagine. It would be a shame to let this time go to waste. Hey, it's Perales. B, you're gonna want to hear this. But first, you need to go somewhere no one's listening. Okay, so my wife, Elizabeth, she's in on the whole thing. She, she keeps saying I should look after myself. Tells me to take these pills. Says they're vitamins. Got them analyzed in a lab. And they look okay. But, but how am I supposed to know if somebody didn't falsify the results? Well, 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 when, when you got a sec, call me, okay? Oh, oh, yeah. And don't forget to delete this message. Hey, V. Orbital connections cost an arm and a leg, so I'll just get right to it. I was just thinking about you, so I laid out a quick tarot and... Oh dear. The fool? 
The moon. The High Priestess. Those, uh... Those are bad cards. Keep a close eye on your new friends, V. I mean it.